drinks on the water and rock music played on an acoustic guitar? Stick around. Welcome back. <laughs> we are at Disney Springs again. again. So if you're new here, we drink and we do things. and we do things. And so normally this is where we go get a drink. Head off to go get a drink, and we are going to do that. We are. However, at the boathouse, um, what's it called? The Dockside Bar. Dockside, Dockside bar, bar out bar. over the water. That's mm -hmm. our first stop. Awesome. So that's our first drink that we're gonna get. So when we get there, oh. we'll we'll get drinks when we get. Oh. oh, we we may have we may have already got some in, some intro intro, intro drinks. drinks. <laughs> you just made something up. Intro drinks. Oh, intro drinks. Let's head off to the boathouse and then we're gonna bring you along for some music. Cheers. Cheers. drinks first and we have them we are at the dockside bar at the boathouse and these are dockside loggers dockside loggers from Florida Ave Brewing, Brewing in Tampa and they're pretty good the cans really pretty too the can has artwork which is this bar which is out over the water behind the main restaurant of the Boathouse. The Boathouse at Disney Springs opened April 13th, 2015. And the people that designed it, that like I think it's Shustler Creative, they're like, they design themed restaurants. And so the same people that designed this designed T-Rex, Yak and Yeti, and Rainforest Cafe. Themed, so it's a boat, boat house theme. Yeah, it's hence, super cool. Hence the name. But this bar is out back over the water, which is pretty good. This is this Lake Buena Vista? Is that what this is called? What's this? This is Lake, I think so, maybe. Is it? I don't know. We're gonna have to look that So up. boathouse theme, which means they have boats. A bunch of vintage boats here, like 20, 25 vintage boats but from Beautiful. the from the 30s, 40s, and 50s. We'll take a look around and show you the boats. And they also have the Ampha cars. Ampha cars, cars that go in the water. Which means they drive on the road and go in the water. It's a little weird. Like they're on the wheels and they drive down the ramp and then they hit the water and they're a boat. And they're a boat. And they're a boat. A little scary. Just like that. So they're, the, the Impa cars are run by the boathouse. Well, in conjunction with Disney, of course. They have like a dozen of them. So those Impa cars were built in Germany between 1961 and 1969. There was about 3,800 of them built wow. originally. That's a lot. They estimate that only about three or four hundred of them exist in the world today. And so when they pitched the theme for the boathouse and they were going to do the Ampha cars, which you can actually pay to go on a 20 minute ride around the lake here, they had to go and find them. And each one of them was bought individually from different private collections. And they were completely retrofitted, you know, obviously, re, you know, uh, restored and actually they upgraded a bunch of the components like for instance the original bilge pump bilge pumps on those cars I guess were known to be um, of not low quality but they didn't really pump water well so like the version that they use here at Disney has like two separate bilge, bilge pumps it's hard to say it is hard to say <laughs> that can actually pump out more water than could possibly come in at any given time so they're very safe which makes sense obviously Disney was going to be safe with those with those cars 
and they upgraded a bunch of components, I'm sure. But they went and found each one of those cars individually. Again, made in Germany. Most of them were sold in the U.S. between 1961 and 69. There goes one right now. There goes one right now. <laughs> the model was 770 because they can do seven miles, or no, they can do seven knots in the water and 70 miles per hour on land. I feel like it would be strange to see one going 70 miles an hour down the road. They're like these little, I don't know, they almost Little convertible cars. Real, yeah. Right? No, if you they, saw they one probably like go, whipping down the road at 70 miles whipping. an hour, whipping, yeah. They probably go like 10 miles an hour to get into the water. Right. But the fact that they can do 70 miles an hour is like kind of funny to me. Karen thinks there's strange music here. It's just a strange mix. Like it goes from 50s to maybe 70s, 70s and 80s, and it's all like this bizarre sort of soft rock that doesn't. And, I, and we've been here before. And I, I don't. It doesn't really fit I, with. Yeah, the but I don't remember that being the case when we've been here before. The, yeah, I don't know what's happening with the music. But today. it is. It is a great bar. This is again Dockside Bar. Dockside Bar, which is out house. on the water. There's another. Bar, there's a raw bar inside. The restaurant itself is um, steaks and seafoods, so it's kind of like they Delicious. call it. They call it like surf and turf, Florida style. And we've sat out here a bunch of times. It's really nice, the especially when the weather is nice. The view's good. You can see set all of the Saratoga Resort um, from from the bar out here. In, in addition to the Empacar, they have this like what they call this Italian vintage. I don't know boat it yacht. Is stunning. Which is like an all wood. Stunning. Uh, Boat, and it goes out on cruises where they give you like chocolate covered strawberries and like champagne. Wait. And there's also a longer version of it where they. And there's also a longer version where they do wine tastings on it. Where you can go out on a wine tasting out here on the lake and that. So stay tuned for a video one of these days of Hughes and Bruce from the wooden yacht <laughs> sampling wine and chocolate covered strawberries. Seriously. They call it a 40-foot Italian water taxi, is what it's called, and that's that wooden boat that's it's parked behind gorgeous. us, and it goes out and you can do a, a wine tasting out here on this As you float on this the water and look expansive, at this, this expansive Lake Buena Vista lake. Wow, we have to do that. We have to do it. And it looks like it might be starting to rain here at Disney Springs. Right after I said it was such a beautiful day. Welcome to Florida. So if you're new here, what we do is we drink and we do things. So today, Boathouse, Dockside Bar for drinks. 
And later we're going to take in a musical act here at the Disney Springs. They're playing at the area which is where the food trucks are. So I'm not sure if that area has a name other than food truck area. We always have problems with the names of the area. That <laughs> we do. The area. We, make, we do. We should we, be better at that. We make up names for the area where the musicians are here. So the act tonight that we want to see is Acoustic Edge. It's awesome. Always something going on here at the Springs. That's why we so, come back over and over again. That's why we come back. And we are back again. And so that's the plan. We're going to finish up our drinks here. Head on over, over to where there. the food trucks are, the and hopefully the rain. Yeah, hopefully yeah. the rain holds out. We'll see. And catch a, catch a show, and we're gonna bring you along. So you don't want to miss out on these crazy adventures at the Springs and other places around Orlando. Hit the subscribe button. It's free. It's free. It's free. It's free to hit the it's subscribe free. button. Go ahead, do it. Ready? We'll wait. We're waiting. Are they doing it? I don't, I don't know. I don't, I don't, I don't, I can't, I can't see where their fingers are. I think they're doing it. Oh, they, yeah, they hit it. We appreciate it. Thank Thanks. You. Thank let's, you. Let's go check out some music. Touching me, touching you. Sweet Caroline, come and tie. 